Hey guys, welcome back to a, another Destiny 2 video. In this video, we're going to go over the Thunderlord Cal Catalyst, which is the brand new Catalyst in Season 18. Of course, every season will have like one new one Catalyst for a old weapon from the previous years, like we had Jotun for last season. Thunderlord will be the Catalyst for this season, and they couldn't have picked a better time with Arc 3.0, as Thunderlord is just going to be the best weapon. My friend told me in public events, it's literally insane right now with Arc 3.0, and one of the best weapons. Weapons everyone needs to get right now. Now there is a bundle going on. I forgot the name of it. Apparently there will be a free bundle for people who just play the game who are just joining in and that will get you Thunderlord for free. So just be aware if you don't have Thunderlord there's some bundles that will be going out for this free week for any of the expansions that are now free and there's going to be an awesome pack so be aware that Thunderlord will be a weapon you're probably going to see with a lot of uh, new pr new guardians that are joining the game. Now how do you get its catalyst? If you go to the catalyst page and you go down to the heavy weapons you will see that the Thunderlord catalyst will be found in Strikes, Gamut, and the Crucible. So nothing too crazy. But Redrix, what does it do, and how much kills am I going to need it as soon as I get it to drop? Well, on Light GG, as we see, you're going to need to kill 500 more enemies with this weapon as soon as you get the catalyst to drop from Gambit, Strikes, and the Crucible. As soon as you get those 500 kills, you will have the Thunderlord Catalyst. And this is what it does. Causing a lightning strike with this weapon partially reloads the magazine from reserves. Yes, return stroke from a weapon that... Literally, no joke, if you see here, partially reloads the weapon after a lightning strike. Final blows with this weapon generate lightning strikes from above, and you don't even need to hit precision. So basically, this thing is going to be an absolute beast with the catalyst. This thing is going to be crazy, and of course, I don't have the catalyst right now, and I can't make a review on something if I don't have the catalyst right now, but I can already tell that this thing is already a beast. With this being paired against now being strong against overload champions, being paired with Arc 3.0 in terms of Ionic Traces and Jolting Enemies now, dude. This thing is already going to be one of the best exotic heavies I could see in the game. And you would not you would expect maybe Ristron or, or Trinity Glue to be the best. And I could see them being really good. But Thunderlord could climb up at being one of the best exotics that people should get. As well as the Catalyst. Hope you guys did enjoy this short video. It's just a small one on how to get the Thunderlord Catalyst in Season 18. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.